Hey, hey! Okay, so, by the way, this is how to import the QR code. Click those three dots, click Import Brush QR Code, and then just select the QR code. You can find the QR code by just screenshotting an image off of the video that I'm about to show you. Anyway, this is my sketching brush. It kind of has more of a natural pencil feel, so I, I really like it. It's a new brush that I just made recently. Also, I just went for like a bike ride. It wasn't even that long, so <laughs> I'm tired. Alright, also I will be making a whole tutorial series for how to draw. And I'll be using these brushes along the way and maybe make new ones. This is another brush that I called Line. I don't know why I spell things so weirdly. I don't usually do line art, I usually tend to just color my sketch. But, um, since a lot of people do line art and would like a line art blush, br brush, not, not blush, I decided to make one. And this is an older brush that I still tend to use sometimes. It's called Perfect. I also have a, uh, I don't know why my, my brain is dead. I also have a newer, I mean, not, not newer, I have a softer version of that brush, which you can use this one for shading and such. Though I kind of abandoned my perfect brushes. <laughs> um, and now I just always use this brush. Shady. I don't even know why I name these things so weirdly. But I always use this brush to shade. I shaded the entire drawing using this brush and only this brush. I don't know why sometimes I slip on... <laughs> I don't know why I sometimes slip up on my words and say like blush instead of brush and things like that. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, so as I was saying in the beginning of the video, I'm gonna make a whole tutorial series on how to draw. As you can see, my anatomy on the character, like you can see that his head's probably too big for his body. So you can see that I'm obviously, obviously not, like, I'm still learning along the way and I don't know a lot of things, but I will still be, I'll still show you guys everything that I know because you guys want to learn, so I'll just be showing you everything that I know, though there's a risk to this. Because I'm not a professional, I might, might possibly misguide you, and if I do misguide you in any way, then I'll make sure to make updates to re-guide you in the right way. Yep, okay. So, for some more information and things, please, please read the description. And honestly, this drawing, the reason why the anatomy is even off a bit is because I made this drawing very, very quickly. I made it in about like an hour and a half. Though my usual drawings could take about like three hours to ten hours, depending. But the point is, I made this very quickly just to, just to show you guys what my brushes can do. Alright, so I can do better than this. I mean, I probably can't do better hair than that. I really like the hair, actually. Alright, so I'll be making a tutorial series, and I hope these brushes come in handy for you guys. Because I'll be using them in my tutorials. So, yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Also, this is my first time. I'm gonna ask you guys to subscribe if you didn't. I'm not used to doing that. Hey guys, hit the subscribe button kind of thing. <laughs> so, um... Yeah, subscribe if you'd like, and if you'd like to learn how to draw or edit, or if you're interested in any content that I have. So, thank you. Have a good night, day, wherever you are. Bye! And please read the description. Thanks. Okay. Bye-bye! Liz just mirrored in my voice, like, crack a little down there, like, bye-bye! <laughs> okay, okay, um, see ya.